Hi, I'm Caroline Hauser. I'm a senior at UNC Asheville and I play soccer. I really wanted a small school setting, like class-wise, and UNC Asheville was just super adamant about that. I wanted to go with Emma, and they loved that, so I was like, this is the perfect school for us. There's a set of twins who are sophomores, and then another set who are freshmen, and we're all identical, and it's just awesome having more twins on the team. For me, it's normal. I don't know if anyone else thinks that's normal, but it's just, they, have the, they play the same way like we do. They know each other very well, and they know where the person's gonna run. Uh, one, of, one of the sets plays different position, one's a forward, one's a defender, but then the other two play the same position. To start with the uh, freshmen, they came in uh, in the spring last year, and we started lifting like the first day, and I could tell they were like a little confused, so Emma and I decided to split up, and I lifted with Megan and she lifted with Rachel, and that way like we just felt like, I would love for someone to do that for me, because when you have someone there, they think, oh, they, they have someone there, like you don't need to help them, but they're still in the same position, they don't know anyone else, so you need help go against each other it's anything goes like I can throw an elbow and sh she'll be fine but we also we have a hard time defending each other because sometimes we get a little too goofy but we love it because we're also very competitive and we want to win if she wins that one the next time I want to go against her and beat her so it's just a very competitive relationship I used to play forward I still do but she used to play outside back and we'd be on the same side and they'd be like wait what I thought I just defended you because we very we look very similar but now she plays midfield, but we still have the same connection, and it's just a lot easier because we've played with each other since we were six years old. We wear different cleats. I wear white, she wears black, so for the longest time people would do that, but people got it usually pretty quick. In sixth grade, there were kids in our class who didn't realize we were twins. They thought we were the same person changing clothes every day. It took them about to October to figure that one out. I've always had someone there for me, and she's my best friend, and it's just Something, something to have there with you. I don't know, if I went to a different school with her, I don't know how that would have gone, but it's nice to, we started preseason together, we were able to do that together, and like, preseason is such a different environment, I've never been anything like it, so having someone there knowing exactly where you're going through and talking about it was just amazing to have. I broke the all-time assist record. Uh, I think I knew about the record sophomore year, and one of my coaches sat me down and said, you have the potential to break this record. So I knew about it sophomore year, and then junior year, I started really assisting more. And then senior year, I only had to get three to break it, so that was one of my goals. And I got it early on, so it was really nice to get that out of the way. I used to be a very big goal scorer my freshman year, but I haven't been able to score as much, so I really wanted to focus on maybe getting the last pass and getting people to score, so it's that way I can help the team in that way, rather than scoring. But I do hope to score. <laughs> but this way I can help the team in that way.